So do you prefer Kat or the Kathleen? Um, I get evenly called both, so I actually don't have a preference. I think my parents prefer Kathleen. So we go by that yeah, All right, Kathleen, uh, would you like to tell us a little bit about yourself? Sure, thank you. Um, my name is Kathleen. I am the first ever representative of Gisborne, and hopefully I plan to start up a regional contest there so you'll see more Gisborne roses in the future. I am currently working at the bank. Um, I'm waiting to go travelling overseas to work in youth camps and on the cruise ships and volunteering hopefully in South Africa. And before coming back and starting my career in the media, um, just sharing my knowledge with the younger people and giving them, you know, sharing current affairs and making it interesting for them so that they understand what's going on. Um, I also have a lot of other activities going on. I have so many interests I couldn't list them all, but I love going to the SPCA and walking the dogs, um, playing my guitar and painting, and just anything I can dabble in, really. <laughs> so you're from Gisborne, which is a great place. I've been there over, just in the New Year period. It was great. Uh, now, you, you would seem to be a very proud representative of Gisborne. So what is something um, interesting you could tell us about the town? Okay, well, most people only know it in summer because rhythm and vines. Um, in winter it does get very quiet and there is not a lot to do. There's a movie theatre and about... Yeah, that's it, the movie theatre. Um, <laughs> but it's actually a really, really friendly place. Um, a lot of people find it a bit scary because of room, you know, just you hear the bad things, but I've always been, felt really safe there. Everyone knows everyone. I started a new job and everyone that came in was really friendly and said, oh, you're new, and they were all very patient. It's, it's really a lovely place and I can't wait to see it grow. <laughs> so if I was asking one of your friends what they would say about you, what do you think the kind of reply I would receive? Do you want to I'm not sure if I'd like to know that. <laughs> no, um, I've always had really good friends and they've always been really supportive of me and always let me know how they feel. Um, they love I think they know I'm very strong into my Irish culture. That they always think I'm very Irish. I would say what traits exactly. Um, perhaps there's a little side on the. I can handle my liquor a little bit. Um, and, well, I think I can. Um, I'm very friendly. I'm always willing to try new things. Hence, getting involved in the rose and. Um, welcoming and just very supportive. I've, I've always been a loyal friend, so I hope they would say that about me. And who is inspirational to you? Well, I have, I do have a few inspirational people, you, you know, Jane Austen, I think, is one who should wait every time, but the person that's inspired me most in my life, definitely not to copy Tegan, but would have to be my mother. Um, she left Ireland when she was 15, she went out on her own. Um, to England, pursued nursing, and came to New Zealand with my father and two sons. Nothing has built the most amazing life. She's the reason why I entered the Rose, and she's just supported me so much. So, definitely, she's a wonderful mother, even when she likes to nag. <laughs> Thank you very much.